Who owns the internet? The complete truth. Internet is a network of networks that has revolutionized communication and the way of transmitting data by allowing large numbers of computer networks across the world to interconnect. Originally invented in the 1970s, the Internet is now used by over 4.72 billion people, which is equivalent to more than 55% of the world's total population. But who actually owns the Internet? No one actually owns the Internet, there is no single person, company, or government that owns the Internet in its entirety. It's more of a concept than a real tangible entity, and it relies on a physical infrastructure that connects multiple computer networks. The Internet contains many different bits and pieces, each of which is controlled by an organization. A few of these organizations can control the level of access the general public has to the Internet. Following are the main organizations that play a crucial in developing Internet technology, standards, infrastructure, and services. They do not own the whole system but can impact your Internet experience. Number 1 Internet Engineering Task Force The IETF is an open community of network designers, operators, and researchers who develop and promote voluntary Internet standards that includes the Internet Protocol Suite. Although operations of IETF have changed a lot since its inception in 1986, the fundamental mechanism remains the same, publish proposed specifications, develop based on the proposals, individually test and review, and republish the revised proposal. All IETF documents and standards are created in an open process and are freely available on the Internet. Anyone can access and modify them. Number 2 Internet Research Task Force Unlike IETF that focuses on short-term issues of engineering standards development, IRTF emphasizes long-term research issues related to the Internet architecture, protocol, applications, and technology. It consists of a number of research groups, including Decentralized Internet Infrastructure Research Group, Quantum Internet Research Group, and Privacy Enhancements and Assessments Research Group. They all are managed by the IRTF Chair in conjunction with the Internet Research Steering Group. Number 3 World Wide Web Consortium W3C is the International Standards Organization for the World Wide Web. Led by web inventor and director Tim Berners-Lee, the consortium develops web standards and software, engages in education and outreach, and serves as a forum for discussion about web technologies. It also focuses on issues of accessibility, internationalization, and mobile web solution. W3C was founded in 1994. It now has 446 members, which include universities, non-profit organizations, governmental entities, businesses, and individuals. Number 4 Number Resource Organization NRO is a coordinating body for the world's regional internet registries. It has three main objectives. Protect the unallocated IP number resource pool. Promote the multi-stakeholder model and bottom-up policy development process and internet governance. Coordinate and support joint activities of the ERs. There are five ERs in the world, which manage, distribute and register internet number resources within their respective locations. Number 5 Internet Architecture Board IAB is a board of researchers and professionals that ensures the Internet continues to evolve as a platform for global communication and innovation. Its responsibilities include managing and publishing requests for comments and overseeing the Internet standard process and IETF activities. In simple terms, the IAB works to Establish the technical direction for an Internet, enabling billions of more people to connect and supporting the vision for an Internet of Things. Ensure that the Internet is a trusted medium of communication. Facilitate the technical evolution of an open Internet with no special controls. Number 6 Internet Assigned Numbers Authority IONA coordinates some of the crucial elements that keep the Internet running smoothly. Its activities can be categorized into three groups. First domain names involves DNS route management. Second number resources involves coordinating the global pool of IP and S numbers. 
Third protocol assignments involves managing internet protocols. Number 7 Internet Society ISAC is a non-profit organization established in 1992. It provides leadership in internet-related standards, access, education, and policy development. ISAC offers forums for discussion of issues that affect the development of the internet. It also serves as a focal point for cooperative efforts to promote the internet as a positive platform to benefit all users across the world. Number 8 Internet Corporation for Assigned Names and Numbers AIC is a non-profit organization made of a number of different groups, each of which represents a different interest on the internet. They all contribute to any final decisions that AIC makes. Their role is to oversee the massive, complex interconnected network of unique identifiers that allow devices on the network to recognize one another. More specifically, AIC deals with IP addresses, domain names, and managers of country code top-level domains. It also promotes competition and develops policy on these unique identifiers. Number 9 North American Network Operators Group Since 1987, NANAG has been committed to the ongoing advancement of an open and secure Internet. It organizes events, meetings, surveys, digital spaces, scholarships, and an influential mailing list for Internet service providers. Their triannual meetings draw about 1,500 people in multiple facets of network architecture, operations, and engineering, who gather in major cities across North America. They discuss various topics, ranging from applications of new protocols to interprovider security and routing scalability. All meetings are informal, and membership is open. Number 10 ISO 3166 ISO 3166 defines the internationally recognized codes of letters and or numbers for names of countries, dependent territories, and special regions of geographical interest. It is published by International Organization for Standardization, an independent, non-governmental entity. ISO 3166-1 Alpha 2 refers to two-letter country codes, which are used for the Internet's country code top-level domains. For example, O is used for Australian domains and F for France. Number 11 Internet Governance Forum The IGF serves to bring all stakeholders together as equals, in discussions on public policy issues related to the Internet. Although the IGF doesn't directly modify the Internet standards, it informs and inspires those with policy-making power in both the private and public sectors. At annual meetings, stakeholders discuss the efficient way to maximize Internet opportunities and address associated risks and challenges. Are you a fiend for technology? Are you constantly curious? Then why not subscribe to Tech Hub? For more clips like this one, and ring the bell for more fascinating content. See you in the next video. Goodbye.